Hi everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Wolfenstein The New Order, with commentary, I might add. Um, so yeah, just a bit of housekeeping at the beginning here, like uh, like in the previous few videos. Uh, it would mean a lot to me if you could just leave a like, uh, put a comment down below. The question for this video, because I've been adding questions to each video, is are you excited at all for Wolfenstein The Young Blood? Because I haven't played it yet. Uh, I've been thinking about it, but I'm not quite sure, I'm not quite sure, like, from looking at it, I'm not quite sure, because I don't, don't want to read up too much about it, to give away plot or whatever, but I'm not quite sure if it's like a full game, or if it's a small game, because I know they announced Young Blood and then Cyber Pilot alongside it, so I'm a bit iffy on whether or not to try it out. Uh, let me know what your thoughts are on it, if you've played it, if you've tried it, put it in the comments down below, I'd be really interested to hear from you. And uh, yeah, can if you, you know, if you feel like it, can you hit that subscribe button as well to keep up to date with all my future walkthroughs. Commentary is something I'll be doing a lot more of now. Uh, if I sound a bit different than I do in the previous videos, I'm trying a different headset. Uh, one that's a bit easier on my my ears and uh, testing the new mic. So I think the mic's a bit better on this one as well. Uh, I think it costs more, so probably. It should work a lot better. Uh, right, so other than that, there's not much I can think of to say to add to that. Uh, right, let's get started, shall we? Oh yeah, of course, I've, I always like say in every uh, video, thank you all for hitting that thumbnail, it means a lot, you know, I'm very, uh, I'm, I'm very appreciative of it. So let's go kill Nazis. Okay, so the sound's a bit better on this headset. And my ears aren't, like, aching. Because the other headset, the earmuffs are a bit too small. Oh, shit. The earmuffs are a bit too small, so they're, like, resting on my earlobe. And, uh, yeah, after a while, it was just hurting. Alright, Nazi time. Well, Nazi killing time. Oh, God. I love how they're just standing there looking at it. They're like, ah, oh, is that grenade gonna kill him? What do you know? It didn't. I can just stay here and let them come to me. This is much easier. The amount of ammo I have to sink into these guys to kill them is ridiculous. Okay, I have to get over there now. Uh, like I said, I said in a previous video that this game doesn't really go into uh, like the world, like the world building that much, but this is kind of, it kind of does in this regard. I do like uh, the fact you get to see a bit of London, and like London's become. Is that everyone? I think that was a lot of them. So let's go take out that machine. That like mech or whatever. Whatever it is. I'm not sure. I'll have to look up. Oh! Hello. It's not crap. It oh, what? Hey, I can't move. Alright, I'm on 60 health. That's not bad. I was on 144 earlier, but yeah, that's war for you. I'll grab that. Oh, there you go, 140. Need to attach this. <laughs> Pull it off. I'll just keep. I'll just, this this entire big gunfight now will just digress into me like, or devolve rather into me just walking over there to recharge the rifle. Yeah. 
Welcome to the land of Nautica. Oh my god, I can't get this. I almost know. What's going on? I don't. Hey, there you go. Hey, armor upgrade. Armor upgrade to what though? Let's, let's check. There's a few armor pieces around here. Oh, there's not much of an armor upgrade. I was already at a hundred, I can't get past a hundred. No, that doesn't seem right. How was that? Well, okay. Just closes behind you. Alright, so, Nazis on the moon. I'm getting that theme from this room. They've colonized the moon. Hey, shotgun! Yep, let's keep going. Don't stop running. Ah, I'm gonna die. Yep, that lean function really comes in handy. I dread to think what the 3D model looks like though when I'm doing this. Okay, Enigma code. Crime rate down in quarantine blocks. Uh, so I have to get, oh, I see it. I have to get down there. How did I get up here? There was a staircase, wasn't it? Yeah, one. Uh, no, wait, there must be some other way down there. Maybe I can jump. Yeah, I get the feeling I'm gonna have to jump. Oh, climb this. 
red. Um, a uh, shotgun's not gonna cut it in this environment. I've only got six rounds. I thought I picked up one. Uh, a sniper rifle should do it. Ah, this is awkward to aim. I'm holding down with three buttons here. Just, <laughs> like, lean. Aim through the sights and fire. Uh, I think I got him. Nope, I didn't. What do you call me? Did you call me something? they appear to be in fine condition. Fine condition. Yeah. Oh, you've got to be shitting me. I can't shoot them. I can't... <laughs> Ah, oh, wow. I can't shoot them unless I've walked up a bit more because, yeah, they, they blow up and kill me. They land on me, blow up and kill me. Alright. Well, now that I know that. Oh! Third time is the charm. Or so I've heard. Okay, so don't jump over there until the elevator's landed and climb up a little bit before I shoot any of the drones. All important things to keep in mind. Okay, climb up a little bit. There we go. That was it. That wasn't a very high climb. Not like far climb, I should say. It is remarkably easy to sneak past the, you know, sneak around this place. I think I found something. What do you see? Ancient artifacts, highly technological in nature. Parchment. Looks like Hebrew. I think the Nazis are trying to reverse engineer all this stuff. Are there any identifying marks? Dot? You should. Dog, Abel, apostrophe, Abel, Tara, space, yoke, item, Charlie, how, Uncle Dog. Might be something in our archives, Anya. See if you can find any references to Dot you should. Will do. Be careful out there. I like her flask a bit. Good catch. Be sure to bring as much of this dot you should stuff as you can carry. Will do. Yep, so he picks up about five pieces of paper and he's like, yeah, that's that'll do. Uh
Oh, what's that? Creating the perfect mind. Uh, it's got one of those stupid panzer hound things. That's not the perfect mind. Unless you think the perfect mind is based on a dog. And then it probably is the perfect mind, but unless that's the case, then no. Is there something I'm supposed to be doing? Uh, oh. Ah. Okay. If I can only climb up this thing. Uh. There's got to be a way up there. Doom-looking gun. Laser craft work. I'll just say laser. It's in here. Do I use the counterweight? I, I can't tell. I don't... Th I assume I don't jump on that. Ah. Never mind. I'll, <laughs> literally, I did that for no reason whatsoever. At least I think I did it for no reason, I'm not sure. I'm not sure what hitting the brakes on the first elevator did. Alright. Oh, bye bye, boy. Alright, I'll just... I can just wait here. Shoot them as they come at me. Oh, right, yeah, that big... Oh, God. I forgot that thing can come up, come upstairs as well. Yes, this would be easier if they didn't have robots and I had an army. You're right, Blaskovitz. Thank you for that observation. Every now and then, I th if I remember correctly, every now and then he does say something like, weird like that. It's like, yeah, it'd be better if I had an army. It's like, yeah, you think?
I, I'm, I'm out of ammo. All I've got is pistol ammo left and shotgun ammo. Got a lot of throwing knives though. That's something. Alright, I'm gonna have to move. Automatic. I can, yeah, this thing can barely last when it was just like one big shot at a time. Full automatic. This gun's not gonna last that long. Like battery wise, I need a battery upgrade. Yeah! One down, one to go. I need one of these guns, just one. No, you can't. Ah, uh, you can't. You can't pull them off the mount. Um, hmm. Alright, if I get over that helicopter. That helicopter might help me. I think. No, it's not facing. Uh, it's not facing the right way. <coughs> oh, God, my throat. Uh, it's not facing the right way. Um. Uh, and I think that's glitched. It looks like it's glitched. No, wait, that's facing the right way now. Oh, no. What's happening? I thought that was it. Eh. I can hear people, can't see people. I uh, gotta be kidding me. Uh, well. Alright, so it looks like they come at me in waves. So there's probably gonna be more. Like mechs? Ah, oh, it doesn't start. Ah, oh, you gotta be kidding me. Really? Checkpoint should come between the waves, not right at the start of the whole thing. Uh, right. Oh, I haven't got the upgrade for this either, have I? I need a uh, selection meal, and this is a bit uh, awkward to use. There you go.
I missed him. Alright, is the upgrade up here? The upgrade was up here, wasn't it? Uh, does that move? Like every time you respawn, I wonder. <coughs> hmm. One more around here somewhere. Hello. Can't get to him. Not that way, anyway. What's going on? <laughs> oh, this thing is slippery. This thing is very slippery. Shotgun should do. Okay, there's more than that around you. What is happening? One minute I'm fine, next minute I'm on 20... 40 health. Uh. Alright, he's gotta come up sometime. Or does he? It uh, doesn't look like it.
All right. Yeah. Uh, oh no. What now? At least this is a safe point. What is there no? Just uh, uh, need to scavenge something because I'm, I'm running out of. Well, I've got six rounds left and next to no health. And then this thing just keeps going. Don't know why. Don't know how. Don't know how much I'm gonna have to put into it. I think there might be a weak spot on its back, maybe. Oh wait, there's a charging station there. Alright. Now I can now I can be 
beat this thing. Oh yeah. Right. All right. Nazi's dead. Nazi robots dead. Broke all your shit. Helicopter secured. That required a lot less finesse than I remember. Just running around shooting people frantically. Well, shoot not shooting people. Uh, that. I thought I was quite finesseful. Finesseful. That's a word. Killing those guys. It's uh, yeah. That last. Well, boss battle was a bit uh, frantic. Uh, finesseful. Is that a word? There's a control on the upper level. From there, you can open the hangar. Well, it is now. <laughs> finesseful sounds like a DC villain. Like Sinestro. Finesseful. That was, uh, that was risky. <coughs> My hero. Oh, imagine if I died then. How annoyed I would be. Uh, oh. I'll take that. Okay, that helicopter. Yeah, done. All aboard! How did you survive? I thought you were dead. Don't remember much. Remember punching Hans Gross in the face. Remember ascending into the sky. For a moment there, I thought it was going to heaven. Then falling, then pain. First pain of my life. Felt like my insides were running out through my back. Could barely move. Had to crawl. So they found me after three days in a ditch. Long months in a Kreisauer hospital bed. They were shoving tubes in me. Infection. Ugh, these things I don't want to remember. I'm sorry about your legs. Don't be. I've learned how to fly. <laughs> Priority. What is the dot ye should? How can we get in contact with them? Anya, what do we know? Very little, but I have some ideas. Good. Anya, you take the lead on this. Blaskovich, whatever she needs, you help her find it, yeah?
William, I could use your help. Could you come over here for a second? Hmm, sure thing. I'm right here anyway. I found some interesting leads. This parchment described um, a way to create a type of super concrete. This is what the Nazis have used to build all these concrete monstrosities around here. Yes, everything, even this place. This is the only concrete they used. This is how they created all those, those cities so quickly. Now that we know where it comes from, I need a sample of it for a closer study. Can you look around here for a piece of exposed concrete that shows an outbreak of mold? It should be porous enough for you to cut me a sample. Whatever you need. Also, there was this encrypted list of Dad Yishut members in Poland during the war. I need to compare it with the official German state records on Jewish citizens in the years between 1939 and 1945. Can you see if those records are in the archives room? I'll get right on that. And there's uh, one more thing. Um, it's quite critical. What? That'll be all. We can go now. Search for moldy concrete. Ah, he's having a hell of a time. Look at him. It's good to see people are happy. Soldier man. All right, hey, key. Keep the door to the archives, you know, like locked that. Doctor Wyatt. Maybe Wyatt has a key. Wyatt, I need the keys to the archives. You got them? Yes. Gosh dang perfect. What do you got there? Dog tanks. Wing Commander Fergus Reed of the Royal Air Force. Took those off of his dead body, wanted to return him to the RAF, but then there was no RAF. Best damn pilot I ever saw in a hell of a soldier. I'm not cut out for this, you know? Cut out for what? This. Everything. I was 18 years old, and suddenly the war was lost. Everything good in the world died. Somehow I was the one supposed to pick up the pieces and keep the resistance going, take on the whole gosh darn Nazi empire. You think I was ready for that kind of responsibility? My ignorance got so many good people killed. You remember Private Prendergast? You know, that guy, he could survive anything. So tough. Well, I got him killed, sent him out on a mission, and he never came back. We just didn't know any better. Wing Commander Fergus Reed. He wouldn't know what to do. He could have saved so many. I made the wrong choice. You made a stupid choice! Yes, you did! You left the boy in charge of a man's work. I should have died on that day, Captain, on that slab, and Fergus Reed should have lived. I'm not a child anymore, Captain. I know where mistakes were made. There. Leave me alone now, you hear? Surprisingly, I mean, I, 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 I wasn't expecting, you know, r realistic sort of, you know, any sort of realism in this game, but uh, it must, like, you know, Blasco's muscles haven't really atrophied in the fact, considering he's been 14 years sitting in that chair or whatever he was doing. I think he was just sitting in that chair. None of his muscles have atrophied. Just pointing it out. But yeah, I think also if no matter who you so choose, if you choose Fergus or Wyatt, they both have so have survivor's guilt. So they both sort of blame Blasco for uh, uh, for choosing them over the other guy. Uh, which is fine, I suppose. I mean, you don't really notice it unless you play it through twice. And I've played this through two or three times prior. It's just a fun little shooter, pick up and play type of shooter. There's a patch of mold. Need a circular saw to cut a sample. Got to be some power tools nearby. Ich verstehe das nicht. Kein einziges Kabel. Alles ist glatt. Auch voll. Okay, circular saw. Ah, oh, right, right over there. Are you okay down there? Max Horst? Quiet 
Mr. Fall there, Mr. Big Cheese. You're in the sewer system now. You will find your way back here if you have a look around, yeah? Alright, Klaus. Back to work. This assessment is not going to Well, that's what you get for pulling the circular saws out of rubble. Yeah, fall into the sewer. What's with the security system in the sewers? I mean, obviously this is where they should be putting security. This is where we're living, but, yeah. You know, why is there weird, sort of, gun turrets in the walls? Uh, right. House of the Rising Sun. This is just more and more tunnels that I'm going to. I should be back in the base now. Like, I'm not that. I, wasn't, I didn't fall that far. Yeah. Welcome back, Captain Blaskovich. Howdy, cowboy. Science project. Well, you're scaring Max. That's not my Sorry, pal. Didn't know he'd flip out like that. That his son? No. Well, kind of. I don't know. So not his son. Used to be Klaus had a son. Born during the war. A miracle, he called it. So he had tried for years to have a child. Him and his wife. Yeah, well, he'd make a pretty good father. For a Nazi. The child was born with a club foot. Klaus knew, of course, what that meant. He begged the doctors not to report it to the authorities. Then secret police showed up to take the boy away. Klaus and his wife tried to stop them. The wife died from a bullet to the head. The child, too. Klaus could not protect them. So he blames himself? I think so. And he will never forgive the Nazis. Alright, so that's Maybe a little bit... On Max. See if he's okay. That's a little bit more we know about uh, Klaus. Klaus and Max. The ca characters in this, a lot of the characters do get... Quite a lot of, uh, like, you know, backstory. Quite a lot of, like, moments. And it's like, ah, that's, that's nice. It's not just a regular sort of shooter then, like Call of Duty. Where some of the characters are just faces. Interchangeable faces. But anyway, I'm going to call an end to this video now because I'm nearing the time limit. Hope you've all enjoyed. It's been great doing this. Uh, I really enjoy I, I'm enjoying doing commentary more and more. And I think I'm getting a bit better at it, I hope, with every video. So, uh, yeah. I'll see you all next time. Like I said, I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you all next time. Have a great day.